Hello, my name is Hilda Rodriguez and today I'm going to talk about click fraud. So, what is click fraud? According to Big Commerce in its article, what is click fraud? How to identify and prevent fraudulent clicks? Click fraud definition is when an individual computer program or generated script exploits online advertisers by repeatedly clicking on a PPC, pay-per-click advertisement to generate fraudulent charges. Click fraud drives up advertising costs, lowers conversion rates, and skews user data for online businesses. Consequently, I believe it is essential to protect our company from this threat, because in the long run, not only it will block potential customers, but it will deplete our advertising budget. Furthermore, our conversion rates will decrease, hurting our company. So, who commits click fraud? Who is behind this? Who does want to deplete our advertising budget? According to Big Commerce in his article, in his article, what is click fraud? How to identify and prevent fraudulent clicks? Big Commerce says there are three types of perpetrators: competitors, publishers, and customers. Competitors. This one is obvious. The competition wants to grab all the customers. To have a better understanding about click fraud by comp competitors, let me give you an scenario. For example, we deploy a pay-per-click advertising campaign about the new perfumes arrivals for fall season. We decide to invest $300 per day and we choose the right keywords to reach a target audience. However, a competitor wants that our ad campaign fails because they want their advertising to grab all the potential customers. So what they do? Simple. They pay someone, use an automated script or use a program that will search for our keywords click on our ad and deplete our budget within few hours. The second one is publishers. Publishers sometimes uh, will, uh, will do it themselves or use their friends to click on the ad to generate revenue for them. Customers. Most of the time, customers click on the ad without knowing that it's an ad. This happens because of the lack of knowledge about pay-per-click and ad placement. Also, the customer does not navigate directly to the website, instead they use the search engine. I have witnessed these two behaviors. A person clicked straight on the ad, so I asked her that she knew that she was that she was on the ad and every time that she clicks on the ad, the business will pay for it. She told me she didn't know that. Consequently, consequently a customer sometimes will commit click fraud without knowing. So, why is a problem? Why click fraud is a problem for a company? First, because of the cost and also the growth. The cost, it could cost a, a, a company thousands or even billions of dollars. And also, it, click fraud is a problem because it's growing every year. In fact, according to Digital Ad Blog in their ad blog post, how click fraud is costing the PPC industry billions, they say. In 2016 alone, it cost advertisers an estimate of 82.0 billion, with estimates for 2017 coming in at 16.4 billion. This is a lot of money wasted, I believe. Also, according to Digital Ad Blog in their blog post, how click fraud is costing the PPC industry billions, they say. The latest estimate in 2017 suggests around a quarter of all clicks on the online advertising are estimated to be a click fraud. So, how to detect click fraud? First, there are red flags that could help us identify click fraud. An unusual in clicks increase from the same similar ISPS addresses. Also, an uncommon increase on the of impressions without conversions. So, impressions are the number of times an ad is shown on a search result. Engine, also an unexpected decrease of pay views and a rise, a rise and bounce rate. The decrease on pay views is when the visitor visits the page during the peak hours in impression of clicks. And the bounce rate is the number of people clicking in our ad and then clicking quickly, going back and to the search result. These are the red flags so we can know that we are being victims, victims of the, to the click fraud. So how to prevent click fraud? First of all, the, we can use Facebook ads. The great news about running ads on Facebook on Twitter is that those ads will show only on those channels. Also, it is perfect solution to avoid click fraud by publishers. Furthermore, the target, 
the targeting options are specific, making the click fraud less. Also, keeping a close track of questionable ISPs addresses is essential. If you keep track, you will be able to exclude, exclude questionable ISPs addresses from AdWords. Another, another solution for click fraud by publisher is running remarketing campaigns. How does it work? The remarketing will run ads to the people who have previously, previously visited the publisher website. Also, it is essential to optimize the targeting areas. For example, exclude geographic regions where there is a suspicious click rate, where there is a suspicious click rate. Also, set up daily budget to avoid going over the budget and don't waste ad budget running ads on questionable websites. Also, be aware of the competition and monitor the keywords. Lastly, there are softwares out there that help us prevent and reduce click fraud. So, what are the solutions? The solutions are in-house, outsourced, web-based, or software. If we decide to go for an in-house solution, it will cost us zero dollars. Or we have to use Facebook and Twitter advertising, we have to exclude the ISPs addresses, and we have to execute the remarketing campaigns ourselves. The benefit is that we're gonna have control over the click fraud. We're gonna manage everything. We don't have to go through third parties. The outsourcer is through an agency. I found two agencies. The first one is click to customers. The cost is between 1,000 to 3,000. The futures is like, they are uh, professionals in Google in Google Advance. Also, they have experience running campaigns with big with big budgets, and also they have experience running uh, campaigns in different markets. The benefits: they employ teams in Google Ads. They have managers that have uh, over three years experience. Also, they close the close work the close working ties with Google, Bing, Yahoo, YouTube, and Baidu. And also, they will give us reports about how our campaign is doing. The second agency is Kosua. The cost is the same, between $1,000 to $3,000. Uh, they have a team of experts for AdWords and Bing, and also they have abilities in the technical, analytical, and creative. Also, the benefits, uh, they have AdWords optimization, they have remarketing, and also they have PPC audits. The third solution is web-based. The, I found one that is called Improvely. They only cost $29 per month. The, the features that they have is conversion tracking. They have agency white label and affiliated marketing. The benefits is that they will fight or we will fight the click fraud through their software. Also, they have a lower customer acquisition go cost also, we don't need to install the software in anything. It's, everything is web-based. Uh, another solution is softwares. The name is called PPC Secure. This one costs $29 per month, but be aware that it's only $29 for 25,000 clicks. It will go over 25,000 clicks. It will cost us $10 for additional clicks. The features is a one account. They have unlimited trackers, they have unlimited domains, they will give us reports, also there is no contract and we can cancel at any time. The benefit is like it's 24-7, it will take only 5 minutes to install the software, also they will keep track of the IPCs, cookies, keywords, browsers, and also if we have any problem, we can email them at any time. In conclusion, uh, I believe it's important to take charge of the click fraud because click fraud is a threat to our ad campaign and it is essential to take precautions. I believe we need to choose a solution that closes match our budgets and strategy. Also, this is the reference pages if someone wants to go back and read a little bit more about click fraud. Thank you.